Mango Seven Oil here. How are we doing today? Welcome to another episode of uh jeez, what is even the name of this game? Starlight Review Relive something or other. It's got a long name, okay? I'm just calling it Starlight though. This is an idol, I-D-O-L, not I-D-L-E. Two different things, gotcha game that plays a lot like Fake Grand Order is what I'm guessing. It looks a lot and plays a lot like that, but with a bunch of um, idol style things. It's also got an anime related to it. We're just going to show you how to re-roll. It just came out yesterday. And before I get into things, um, re-roll for characters and who you like and what personalities you're going for. Don't re-roll for power. I mean, you do you if you want to re-roll for power in a game like this. But just know that um, there's a lot of power creeping. There's a lot of stuff like that from what I understand. And I would definitely pull for who you like instead. So just to give you a really quick um, look at the combat before you go, this is what it looks like. Um, we're in the tutorial right now. It's a general little look at what it seems uh, to be. And there's lots of good music too, like if we up the sound here. It is an idle game, of course. We can climax really quick. You can see my little take on it uh, on my video yesterday. This is meant to be a reroll guide. I just wanted to show people really quick here. <laughs> Then we can hit start. Uh, the whole reroll process takes about 10 minutes, I would say, once you know what you're doing. Um, I'm not going to walk you through it all because it is just so fast it's not worth it. What I'm going to get to is when you first get in the control of your characters, and we'll be back in just a second when we're there, and then that's kind of where your decisions matter. So we have our free gacha here. It doesn't really matter what you get. Um, you're basically guaranteed the two star right here. And then the rest seems to be RNG. I think you get a mix of uh, memoirs and you get some other two stars, but it's different each time. Uh, but I seem to get the same split every time. This is not where your rerolling actually matters. So we'll spin a little bit after uh, once we get some freedom. Okay, so we're finally there. We're finally where it matters. So the first thing I do, um, go to presents, hit receive all. Um, you'll know when you're here because you actually get freedom and all the daily logins and stuff pops up. So this gets you a bunch of stuff, but most importantly, it pushes you over in the um, star gem section. Spamming there. From this point on, we also go to beginner, and I think you need the star gem gacha ticket. Not sure. And then we go straight to the gacha. It's right 10 minutes in. Now, there's a couple ways you can do this. Um, some people are recommending going for Halloween, which is only here for six more days. Um, and that is pretty cool. But the four star stage step up is just so important that I think it's hard to miss. Um, and then you have 24 hours to do your redo. And I'll explain the redo in just a second here. So the way I recommend doing it is um, going through this step up thing twice. And if you look at step up, I think you it through here i'm not actually um but there's two steps um the first step no it be there the first step of the step up is just a regular pull for 1500 and the second step up it's uh one with a guaranteed four star so from this two step up things it takes 4500 star gems you will get one four star at least and um, a bunch of other things uh this is where you want to reroll, and i tried for three Four stars, which is pretty rare, but it's definitely happened, um, and I'll show you my account in a bit. But you should be fine just taking two. I would take basically any with two of some characters you really like. We'll go over the characters in a bit too at the end as well. Let's just do the first one here to show you. And keep in mind there are memoirs in this game, much like worm prints, much like artifacts and everything. So I obviously just hit skip through everything, and we got basically the bare minimum, um, no four stars or anything. So at this point, what I would do is still roll the step two gacha here and then um, see if we get multiple four stars and maybe keep it there. Because even if you don't get anything in your step one, you could still get like three four stars in your step two. We're not going to do that this time, though, because um, I want to show you what the redo looks like. And that's kind of the important part. So once you get your step one and step two, your two to three four stars, uh, whoever you want to start with, head on over to the story and you just clear the story up as far as you want. And then you go to the redo. You have 24 hours from your account's um, initiation, so when you create the account, you do this redo. And this is a four-star girl guaranteed, and uh, this is only right at the start of the game. You get a four-star from every single pull. So um, 
You get a four star here and then you get four others and you can redo it as many times as you want. If you come from Epic Seven, um, think of this like a selective summon that you could do infinity amounts of times. Um, you cannot get two four stars from this and um, you can get three stars though. You could get one four star and four three stars if you really wanted. Um, yeah, and you just keep doing this until you find the girl you like. And I'll show you tier list in a second. You know, you're like, wow, where's the tier list? But I go for, go for cuteness and everything first. Um, so I personally re-rolled for, um, it does download for a little bit, but once you download all the things, I should show you where that is too. In a second, um, it'll stop downloading. I re-rolled for this one. She is who I picked. Her name is Shizuha Kocho, and she likes fruits. Her favorite food are fruits, and I figured as a mango, probably be pretty good friends. Um, so yeah, and then once you do this, you hit confirm, confirm there, and then you've got your starter account, and you can start playing the game from here. Uh, that's the important part. And it's really, really easy to reset the account. That's the best part here. So if you want to reset the account, um, oh by the way, just make sure you should download all the game data here, uh, just so you don't have all those loading screens. All the time. Uh, but if you want to reset the account, all you do is go to return to title screen. In the bottom right over my head, um, to get here, you click on other. You go return to title screen, return to title screen. Then you hit support at the bottom left. And clear player data. Uh, you don't have to save your account until you've got the one you like. You can run as many instances as you want, no problem with this. And it's just fantastic. It's a pleasure to reroll in. It takes about 10 minutes each time. Um... So who to pull for? That's what you're here for. Let me bring up uh, the tier list that people have been using and we'll talk about that a little bit. Okay, so I'm going to leave a link to this in the description below. This is kind of the reroll guide that everybody I know is using. I cannot confirm on their tier list or anything like that. I have no idea what's actually right, but it definitely seems laid out enough that um, you should be okay using it. So, these are the things. This is my best girl and I'm picking her no matter how bad she is. That's kind of what I feel like for a lot of things. So if we scroll down here, it kind of shows how people perform in the short term and the long term and it tells a little bit about them. So I definitely um, would take a look at this to at least get an idea of the girls, but uh, I do not recommend following tier lists because they change so much. Before we look at the tier list here, as uh, we go in, this is the account I started with. I haven't spent any money yet, but I will be. I did just finish my redo. But I ended up with um, Maya, I ended up with Aruru, who is uh, basically my favorite right now that I got that wasn't the one I was going for. I ended up with Shizuha Kocho, who is the one I rerolled for. I ended up with Akira Yukishiro, who is the one I'm least happy about. But I'm stoked about these three, uh, so this is what I ended up with. So let's go take a look again at your list. So I ended up with Maya, short term really good, long term not so good. Apparently there's a lot of power creep. Um, there's Yachio, who I think uh, a lot of people are recommending as like the number one to pick from the Redo Gacha, so put that as well. I also got Shizuha, who was the one I was aiming for, really happy about that. And then I picked up, um, where is she? Akira. So that is basically everybody. Oh, there's Aruru too. Did we pass Aruru? Um, did we pass Aruru? I think we did. Oh, she's right at the top, right, right, right. So I, I also picked Aru here. Aru, Aru, Aru here. I don't know how to say that name. One last thing to help you out with your re-rolling fiesta here is the fandom. The wiki, whatever you want to call it here. This is how I re-rolled, honestly. I was browsing this for a little while, taking a look at all the characters and kind of reading a little bit about her. We can see from Shizuhu, Shizuha Kocho's... God, I need to figure out how to pronounce these names. Um, school outfit here, and then we can see what she looks like in review, or one of the things at least here. And you can see all sorts of stuff around her. Like, she likes fruits in general. Um, she likes making healthy drinks, and she likes tongue twisters. This is the kind of game you're playing. You can also see their birthday. Maybe your birthday is August 16th. Want to match up your birthday with something. Like, this is the type of game this is, so know this going in. We can see Claudine, the bane of my existence. We can see Banana. Um, we can see Juna, Mahiru, all these other things. And if you click into them here, you can take a look at their school outfit and what they look like in review and kind of what weapons they have. well. Um, Mahiru was the one I was originally really happy with, and I still would be, but um, she doesn't like 
mangoes. So, you know, that kind of puts the other one ahead. But yeah, um, there you go. That's how you reroll. It's really, really simple. This tier list is in the description below. I know you guys want it, but please, 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 if you're going to play a game like this, play it for the girls, play it for the music, play it for everything like that. Um, don't play for tier lists because you'll always be ch chasing that, like, whoever's release is better and the power creep and everything like that. So thank you so much for watching. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe as always, and I would love to see more of you in this game. I'm really enjoying it so far. Uh, have a great day. Bye, everybody.